Appalachia online, Captain. I know most of you love America. Good old red, white, and blue. But those of us who served at Mariposa know something. America failed. Not because of its citizens. Lived clean lives filled with hardship in a never-ending war. Certainly not because of its fighting men and women. God bless them. No. Its leaders failed us. Senators, generals, presidents, all those bastards. Their failure almost destroyed all mankind. But I look around here, and I see survivors. People too stubborn. People too damn ornery to die. We've fought, and we've endured, and we finally have a small patch of safety. Having a home isn't enough. We need something more. What we need is purpose. We cannot look to the America of old for that purpose. We have to build our own. So tonight, as we break bread together, let us forge together something new, something strong, something we can be proud of, something we can build upon. We'll preserve what's best of what's come before us and use it. And one day, we will reclaim what was lost. Let us forge a brotherhood. A state. Congratulations, Appalachia. Paladin Taggarty told me of your victory at Huntersville. I know it was costly, but future generations will thank you, as I am thanking you now. It makes me proud, but that's not why I'm calling. One of the Brotherhood's standing orders is being on the lookout for valuable technology, anything that would help us in our efforts. But as I look in every direction, I see chaos. The lights are out, and men have become little better than barbarians. Civilization. Civilization is something I think of as dead. I don't really want to think of the word right now. To rebuild that, to reclaim that, our successors are gonna need the secrets of the past. And those secrets are in danger of slipping through our fingers forever. So far, our scribes have been tools to help protect our knights and maintain our bases. That needs to change. The Brotherhood is going to be more than an armed fighting force. We are going to be the guardians of civilization. So we have to grab every schematic, every holotape, every book, every goddamn note that holds the building blocks of the old world before it is too late. Our scribes will hold on to them, preserve them, perhaps even progress beyond them. And the knights will protect them. A hard shell around a precious seed. One day when the time is right, that seed will grow and a new civilization will be born. This, this is why we were born. Don't you see it? Helping your fellow man is a good goal, a soldier's goal. But this, we will be the catalyst that changes the world. I'm sure you have questions. Ballad integrity is fully brief. I have every faith in you, Appalachia. Elder Maxon, out.
Camp Venture. Just who was this Brotherhood of Steel? Survivalists? Former army personnel? They, they took their training and their call signs seriously, that's for certain. Organized, efficient, access to hardware? You'd think they'd be ruling West Virginia by now. But they're gone. If they're following military logic, then they'll have a fortified headquarters somewhere. And a leader. Someone who knew what they were planning. Thank you, Captain. It's just us. Lizzie. What's on your mind? A Brotherhood of Steel. What's that even mean? The men over here are confused. We need to do something bold. We can't just stay the U.S. Army. What's gonna happen, and this is only a matter of time, is some general or some goddamn politician is gonna exit a vault and start ordering us around. And worse, they'll order some grunt to start the whole goddamn cycle again. Another wave of nuclear death, and if that's not enough, they'll do it again! You know they will, Lizzie. It ends with us. We won't let them. Uh, I understand. But a brotherhood? Knights? Am I supposed to call you, what, Elder? Words have power, Lizzie. They build identity. They take on a meaning if you keep using them, even if it didn't exist before. It was the Knights and the Scribes, after the fall of Rome, that protected what was left of Western civilization. So we are the new Knights, and our role is similar. But we'll need more than names. We'll need new traditions our own mythology. Something people can believe in to their core. Is this necessary? What else can I do? Declare myself president? Make you a senator? Look around, Lizzie. Something's killing us. More than the rads and the freaks out there. Depression. People have lost everyone. Every goddamn soul. Wives. Kids. Loved ones, even the goddamn mailman. We need to replace it with something. Otherwise, people's souls will be little more than walking dead men. I'll do my best to see the orders carried out, sir. Give it time, Lizzie. People have a hunger to believe in something. Just let them work their way to it. 